Today I am going to show you, show you the Hornby Track Cleaning Car. It has pads underneath it, which are sort of like, as you can see, there are the pads there. Oh. There, they're there. The pads, I don't know if you can see that. Leaf pads. Well, those pads have like, those are like, leaf, there's, there's a weights inside there and they push it down and those pads can those pads can be replaced as Hornby as in the set and the box of it they come with a few out here right is Hornby say it is better to push it so I do with with a loco bigger than an 060 so so loco um all right same size that there um so let's use my class four seven oh we're not stone Give us the power. Right. So let's have a go. This is my new class forty seven. Oh, wrong number. Sorry. Very bad driving. So then we'll go on there. Just go around a few times until it's clean so I'm just going on, right. Some people say I did this at the start and got methylene spurts. I don't know, you can get like a bottle of fine. And like get the cotton buds and put it underneath and wipe it up and down the pads. It does help I think, but not very much and you have to keep doing it. But if you do it when you're finished it wipes the dirt and all of them. But the truth is you're better with a track rubber. There's a Pico one I have here it is here. It's the box of it. Or that fancy jack dapple flat cleaning track cleaning car. I don't have a money for it at the minute, so everything in my layer is like super budget. And this is like this is like um, a temporary layer. We'll stop that in the next go round. There's a temporary layer. It's just like on the hornby track plan and there's like oil and stuff. Now we'll stop it there. I cleaned my whole track with methylates first, like on cotton buds, and it took forever, but and it didn't really work that well. So, here we go. There's a bit of dirt on it, but not very much. Because I have it all cleaned. It doesn't clean the best, to be honest. And on the side, it's fitted with a good livery. It says Track Maintenance Department. I don't know if you probably can't see that, and it has like a C1. It's sort of like, like the old coaches, mine is like really bad condition. And then um, practically put in a different livery. And it has like weights and like pretty dying things. It does, but it seems very expensive for the price. It's about 20 quid, 16 to 20 quid, you can raise from. And I got mine for a fiver off eBay, so I was doing well. Right, thanks for watching and I hope to see you again sometime soon.